guys, it's H4, aka Beardnor himself, and I'm gonna forgo my intro because this is a PSA, it's kind of important. It's important for other people that do YouTube and do videos online and stuff like that, and it's gonna be something that uh, I hope you guys take heed to. Um, recently, my uh, MCN had posted a video on their channel stating that uh, people are getting their channels shut down for quote unquote spam and uh, the spam in question is tags in the description so it's not even like a weird thing it's like a thing that's been around for YouTube for a long time and suggestively it's it's the idea of the tags are misleading but uh, again that's very much at the toss-up of what uh, you know the guy at YouTube who s reviews whatever uh, flagging uh, for spam tags in your in your description he has the chance to go 50 50 either way he could decide that it is spam or it isn't even if it's related to your content and so uh, I just wanted to po you know post this and get your attention to it and uh, to have you take a look at this and so I, I have here a screenshot of a Twitter feed of a website called um, spam 404.com which basically they're pseudo internet police where you can report things that are abusive on the internet specifically to do with YouTube and, and uh, a couple other websites. And, uh, you know, this is from their Twitter feed. Somebody was having a conversation with someone else saying, you know, your, your subscriber count and your Twitter followers don't line up, which to be honest, mine don't either, which has nothing to do with anything. It's very, that's very uh, circumstantial. Uh, but uh, the guy was saying, you know, Thunder shouted me out, and the guy was like, oh, yeah, damn, he probably did because, you know, you didn't have those views before. And um, the guy's like, here's video proof, have a good day. And then someone else joined the conversation and posted a video, and he's like, please look at this for an abusive description. And it's a video from Thunderstruck Gaming, and they say, thank you for, for reporting this video. As a result, we found 30 plus violations from this user. Now, let me clarify here. Looking at this picture here, you see this is the Thunderstruck video they're referring to, and uh, you can see all the tags down in the description. Now this, to me, I don't care. This doesn't bother me at all. It shouldn't bother you at all. It's just it's just information to help search engine, resu engine results. Now I understand a lot of this is just uh, repetitive and different variations of, uh, of words and stuff like that, but when you write your tags in YouTube, if you do YouTube, that's a very normal practice to write Call of Duty Ghost and then write COD instead of Call of Duty, or to write uh, Blops 2 instead of Black Ops 2. Things that people will type into search and you want to put in your tags, this is normal. And a lot of people used to copy and paste these into their description to help with the search engine because sometimes the description picks up better than the tags underneath, especially if you have uh, things a little bit repeated or anything like that so in different variations. Now this one is a little bit spammy and I will agree it's a little spammy, but uh, the trick thing with this is that, again, this doesn't hurt me, doesn't hurt you. And if this helps this dude get a few more views and get his channel a little bit of exposure and he's doing it in a place that's not like in the comments section, it's not, he's not spamming Twitter, he's not bothering you in any way. This is just if you decide to look at the info about, you'll see the info at the top there, but then there's this block of thing that's it's not meant for you, it's meant for uh, the search engine. You know, I could understand if it was completely unrelated and some of these things are in this case, but if it is related, it shouldn't be a problem. And so, because of this thing, this is considered a spamming violation. Now, Spam404 goes ahead and forwards this to YouTube, and then they make a decision as to whether it's spam or not. Now, if they flag it, if YouTube flags it, then you get a strike. And if you have multiple videos with this, say you have 20 videos with some tags and stuff in it, then now you have 20 strikes. It only takes three to shut down your channel. So, and then your channel's gone, period all your videos, everything. And so this is a serious thing. And there's apparently been a few big channels that have been shut down by this. And this is, to be honest, like this is an example of, of more spammy style tags, but even I would put related tags in my description to, because it helps augment the search engine. I've seen the results of this. Videos that don't have it versus videos that do, you do get a little bit more views, you do get a little bit more exposure. But I've gone through all my videos and deleted all that shit. Even if it is related, I'm not taking the chance that it's, you know, that this YouTube reviewer is going to decide that it's going to be one way or another. If somebody takes a disliking to me or decides that they don't like me for whatever reason and they, they want to get back at me and they know about this site, they could turn around and say, well, you know what, that looks like spam tags. 
I'm going to go report this to spam404.com, and then they're going to go turn around and report it to YouTube. And they're going to comb through all my vids looking for little things like that, and it only takes three. And if three go through, then I'm gone, right? So that's stupid. That's a stupid thing, and it's a dangerous thing. And if you don't believe me, you know, I'll, I'll link in the description. You can see the picture here. This is, this is George Vanos from Freedom putting a video out to let us all know that this is a thing, and this is a... Uh, something to be careful about. The thing I'm curious about is in the case of uh, Thunder's video here, and this is the first I've heard of the Spam 404 thing. In Thunder's video, this is Thunderstruck Gaming. This is his community channel that he uses to help smaller YouTubers grow their channels, and it works, and it's something that, that is very effective for them. And does Thunderstruck Gaming get hit with this strike if this goes through? Or does the YouTuber that posted to Thunderstruck get hit with it? And I'm guessing likely it's going to be Thunderstruck Gaming. So Thunder, if you're watching this video, I'm going to sh send it to you and, and give you a heads up. But if you're watching this, be careful about the things that the people put in the descriptions on, on your community channel, man, because they may just close your shit, and that's fucking bullshit. It's absolute bullshit. Be careful, guys. Anyone who's doing YouTube, be careful, and don't let this happen to you. Uh, I'm taking action on my own channel and, and removed anything that could be misconstrued as this but you got to understand that there's people on the internet and if they don't like you guess what they're going to do they're going to try and find shit like this and they're going to try and take you down and so don't give them anything don't give them ammunition and be careful guys again i'll catch you guys on the next one i hope this helped you guys i hope you guys are not in danger of this in any way and as always stay beardly my friends and i'll catch you on the next one cheers